For bundle dye, these are just a few of the items you're going to need. Just a pair of scissors, any type of string, and a water source. So we'll start with our fiber wet. And this bowl is one part white vinegar to three parts water. And you just want to get your piece wet enough so it's all the way soaked through and it's not, you know, dripping wet when you take it out. So I'll squeeze out any excess liquid so that my cloth is damp. Set my bowl to the side and lay out my cloth. This is a silk chenille fabric that I obviously have stained. Um, and bundle dyeing works really, really well to cover up stains. So now I'll start to sprinkle my red cabbage. This will get us a nice pretty pink purple color. And then I'll place down some purple carrots. Those will get us a nice purple color. I also have my whole turmeric. And I will sprinkle some of my fresh turmeric. And we'll put down red and yellow onion skins. Something else you can do is cut shapes out of your vegetables. So if you knew you wanted very straight lines, you can cut onion skins really easily. You can also cut purple carrots really easily. So say I wanted to do a heart shape. I could cut this purple carrot into a heart. Now I'll add some oxalis flowers. I'll take my lemon wedge and just drizzle it on different parts of the cloth. So the acid in the lemon will brighten any area that it comes into contact with. So this example is going to be really bright and colorful and beautiful. Now I'll show you how to wrap it up before we put it in our steam basket. So I'm just going to roll the fabric onto itself. It's like making a spring roll since this is a food dye class after all. And I'm rolling it just tight enough that the plant material isn't going to fall out of the sides. So it is pretty loose. And now I'm going to roll it in the opposite direction. And we'll make a cinnamon roll going this way. And we'll secure all of this up with string. When you're tying up your cinnamon roll, 
You can start with a double knot and just continuing to wrap it around the whole width of the bundle. And you'll secure it with a double knot as well. So that's ready to go in our steam basket. So taking a look at our bundle from the outside, you can even see where there might be a purple carrot, a red onion skin in this case, and some turmeric all throughout. So let's see what we have. 